farmers. This is Menid Farms. I'm Morris Mumbere. Today I'm talking about blood and how to overcome it. How to help a goat get rid of this. Ah, the causes of blood. We have two major causes. The first cause, it is uh, osphagus destruction, whereby a goat can have a goat will have taken something and it blocks the osphagus. And it will be, it will fail to to bring out the gas. It will block out the gas inside the rumen. The second cause, it is majorly by a way of feeding, that is dietary. Uh, why? The first issue, once a goat takes a lot of grains, like maize grain, uh, when the, when it reaches the rumen the goat will fail to chew the card, meaning that the microbes inside the rumen will, will die. And another issue in, in, in accordance to, to, to feeding, uh, when, a goat, when you change the diet of a goat, a sudden change, uh, it, is also, it will also cause blood. How? Uh, the rumen Inside the rumen there are microbes and these ones are used to the previous feed. So the problem comes, this food will change the pH inside the rumen and these microbes which work on the food will die. After dying then the, the, the inside the rumen these microbes which are remaining there, we call them the bad, room, bad microbes. They will not they will not help the food to break down and in, in as a result there will be form no, a formation of foam and this foam will block the air and as a result of this you will find that on the left side of the goat there is a bulge it is it will be as if a goat has swollen a ball so that's what you see here like this goat it is having a lot of gas inside and the left side is too hard, you can see, but this side is soft. So now, the first aid to help this goat is that we are going to give it cooking oil. Uh, this oil is going to break the foam, such that there will be movement of gas inside the rumen. So you can see how we are going to give it. first aid of cooking oil to break the foam. So if the situation persists, then the next step we shall have to prick the rumen to expose off the gas inside. That one will be the second stage when things fail. Dear farmers, as you have seen, the way we are dealing with blood, blood so I urge you to subscribe to our channel and our Facebook page for other educative videos in order for you to be in the, to be in the next generation God farming. Thank you.